Boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to a new video where today, I know, I know, I know I'm late to the party. I'm a week late since this collection got released. Very, very sorry. Been working um, extra shifts uh, recently and have had a short few days away. It's all been too, too manic. It is crazy, crazy. But I'm so glad to be back and start getting reviews up for this collection on the channel. And weirdly enough, we're starting off with the Mega Multi Pack because why not? It is awesome. Four packets, two limited edition cards. And uh, as you say, a bit of a price hike this year, a bit of a shame, but nonetheless, it's certainly not going to stop us collecting, is it? So. As you can see, 48 cards plus the limited editions makes it 50 cards per multi-pack for the price of £10. Not woeful, to be fair, um, but obviously, but obviously no one likes to see the price hike. But to be fair to Tops, everything in the world has been going up recently. So, uh, yeah, you can't get too annoyed at them. You can't get too annoyed at them. So, without further ado... Here are all our gorgeous packs on a nice bit of cardboard, which we'll uh, put to the side. We don't want to see that. Um, no cardboard backpack openings. So, um, obviously, we will save the limited edition packs till last, even though there's nothing too crazy you can get in them. These packs are probably uh, quite a bit more exciting, obviously, because these uh, endless possibilities for what you can get in those. But it's just tradition on the channel to save the limited edition packs till last so there you have it so here you are standard packets my first time opening on the channel i have opened some of these packs off camera um and if you've watched one of my recent videos you would have seen that i even managed to pack a autograph from a tin i won't spoil it go watch it if you haven't already um if it's up before this one it'll probably be up after so wait a couple of days actually i'm chatting rubbish wait a couple of days but here is the stats. We won't look too much into those. 12 cards per packet. Three special inserts, special inserts guaranteed per pack. Without further ado, let's get into these. What are we hoping for today? A chrome shield, a black edge, something like that would be really nice. Um, Harland 101. Um, yeah, as I said, I'm not after anything too spectacular. Just to get some um, extra cards in the binder is always important. So we start off with a code card. I won't be using any of those, so please do take them away. Then, <coughs> excuse me, we have our base, Deo Okamakano, uh, Milinkovic-Savic, um, missed one there, Kolo Moani there, been linked with so many teams for a long time now. We have Luis Diaz, we have Garnacho, one of the star boys to pull in the collections last year. We have Mikel Antonio, Super Antonio, love that as a Hammers fan. We then have Nabel Fakir, uh, Fakari Tamori. And then, are we on to our shinies? We are. Oh, oh, no, we're not. We've got a base. Oh, look at that. If you were listening closely, being a West Ham fan, what a lovely card. The West Ham badge have not pulled that yet either. So that is a lovely pull for the collection. But because it's one of those badges, captain cards, I'll be leaving it in with the base sets. We then have Rodrigo Crystal Parallel, which is a very, very nice Crystal Parallel to get. Love the Crystal Parallels personally. I know some people are fans, some people are not. But I'm definitely a fan. I'm definitely a fan. And then you have uh, Eliminator Schlotterbeck. Really nice. I like that these Mirafoils aren't shoved in packs as much as last year. It's not always just two per pack. And then we're going to finish off with a Callum Wilson Limited Edition. Welcome back to Topps Match Tax Newcastle United. Callum Wilson. Fantastic. Fantastic card. Um yeah, love the signature style on those. Really, really nice. Um, Got to admit, from the packs open so far, I think um, uh, the Heritage are probably one of my favourite. Just how they've got the texture of the cards bang on right as well compared to the... You know, everyone remembers those. Uh, if you're an OG collector like me and you remember those orange um, back match tacks and it had those same feel. Oh, just such a retro vibe. Love it. We have Ruli. We have Willie Auburn. We have Santiago Jimenez. Or Jimenez, uh, Julian Alvarez, uh, Pedri there, that's a nice one, Fabio Vieira, um, Pav Pavlovich, uh, Pedro Goncalves, and then we have a uh, Chiri Immobile captain, really nice. As I say, it's, it's nice because they've not made these captain, they're like in between base and shiny, they've got the shine down here 
and the base for the background. So it's a nice little in between almost, uh, which is cool. I'm happy with that. I'm happy with that. Uh, after that, we have um, a card stuck to a card. It looks like we've got another Crystal Parallel already. We've got this time Sal um, of Atletico Madrid once had that loan spell with Chelsea. There's a nice one. There is a nice one. Erling Haaland finisher card. Oh, that's a gorgeous card, isn't it? Lots of Haaland collectors out there. And then we finish off with a cult hero for Pereserve Arsenal. Felt like that there was another card stuck to it, but it's just... Feels like maybe the cards are better quality. I'm not sure. It's just It just felt quite thick. But there you have it. So nothing too crazy to write home about yet. Did get a nice Haaland pull, though. Um, oh, wow. We've got a black edge. Nothing to write home about no longer because we've got a black edge. For I will be honest, I've actually got three of the black edges so far, which is really good going. Um, so, uh, you know, I've got just over half a chance of it being a need. So we've got the Sal parallel and the base now. We've got Ashraf Hakimi. We've got Alfonso Davis of Bayern Munich. Uh, Tuchel Many there. Uh, Martinez, another welcome back to match tax for Aston Villa. Uh, Ibrahim Akanate, which I've seen hundreds of times. Marcus Turan there. And uh, we get into our black edge. We are very close. We have Paolo Dybala. And then we do have our black edge. Come on, please be a need. Which way do I do it? It's not that way. It's the other way. So, three, two, one. Bang! Gabriel Jesus, black edge edition card. Absolutely gorgeous. And you know what's beautiful about that? It's one I need. I've got a Giroud. Um, I've got uh, Usman Dembele. And I've got one other that I can't remember off the top of my head. But it definitely, definitely is not Gabriel Jesus. So that is a fantastic pull. Absolutely chuffed with that. Gabriel Jesus, Black Edge Edition. Welcome to my binder. You can go right centre stage. Um, well, I think Wilson's going to say centre stage for now. But... You're pretty close to centre stage. There you have it. What a fantastic pull that is. We then have the final badge. We then have him and his eliminator. And then we're going to finish off with another man of the match. Signature style for Pavlovich there. Who we've already had the base card for. As I say, the only thing I am gutted with for this collection. Is just a selfish thing that I'm gutted about. And it's that West Ham have not got any um, Rainbow Fall cards. So I know they've got their Mirror Falls. Like the Eliminators and Finishers and all that. But no Mirror Falls. No Black Edges, Man of the Matches or Cult Heroes. Or anything like that for West Ham in the collection. Oh, which is gutting, but I suppose there's so many Premier League teams in it this year that it's very difficult to uh, put them all in. It's very weird even seeing the likes of Chelsea not in the collection. But there you go. So, digital code card, and we've got the rest of our base. We've got Philip Max, we've got Danilo Piera, we've got Bino Gittens. Uh, meant to be a good young talent, up and coming. We have Victor Lindelof and Mark Thomas Socek there, lovely stuff. We have Alaskin, we have Luis Felipe, Rafael Leal, what a player that is. And then we on to our shinies and mirror foils. We have Ulmer captain card, nice one I haven't seen yet. We have this Cabell, which I have seen many a times, but still nice nonetheless. We have a legendary moment, Patrick Cliver. What a fantastic little addition these are to the collection. And then I think we have one of my favourites. We do a Gianluca Mancini heritage card. I just love those. I don't know if I'm getting it, but you can always see where it's sort of... Um, don't know, not spikes, but sort of they've just got those pointy... I can't explain it, but they've just got the background spot on. And they are absolutely gorgeous. So, um, yeah, you can go there for now. And you, because you're sideways, can go there. Oh, everyone's happy. Everyone's happy. So, last but not least, we have our two limited edition pack. I am I think I've been spoiled, right? And I've got a nice mixture of everything, including that Jesus Black Edge. I'm not going to complain with this multi-pack at all. I would say I've got lucky. Let me know in the comments below if you think I've got lucky, because I certainly think I've got lucky. So we have got our limited editions. There is the first code card. The ideal limited edition, I'm still looking for that Paqueta as a West Ham fan, but I'd like to get two of those for my personal West Ham collection. Let me know if you'd like to see a, uh, a video of that one day in the future. 
But we have got a Bruno Guimaraes, his Brazilian partner in midfield there. That's a really nice card and one I haven't got yet. So that's fantastic stuff. And then we do have a Atletico Madrid Antoine Griezmann limited edition. Another one I don't think I have, albeit I don't think I have many more than maybe eight or nine of the limited editions. So to get two new ones is a big win in my eyes. I must say. So there you have it. Two new limited editions, couple of parallels, heritage, couple of legends, black edge, even a Haaland finisher and the West Ham badge for me personally. I think that's a great multi-pack. If you did enjoy, please make sure to like, subscribe, do all that good stuff. And we'll be back with more Mass Attacks uh, collection videos very, very soon. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.